we are now at the pit stop build player in Rud and Optimus Prime is gonna get a little treatment, a ceramic treatment. So he's been wrapped in the front now with the Lumar, but um, these guys they will take they will spend two days working on the car. Uh, they wash it and they'll uh, put some uh, some coat on it. Yeah, I'm not I'm not an expert on this, you know. So I I have never done a coating on a car, neither this one or the Falcon before. But uh, from what I heard, yeah, they put uh, like a paint sealing, a protection on it, and then it's supposed to repel dirt and everything, and also protect it better against all the elements. And uh, I drive a lot, so um, yeah, I hope this one will give you good protection against all the schmutz we have in Norway. But um, all right, uh, so you are you going to work on the car? Yes, I am. And what what kind of treatment is it? Uh, this is ceramic treatment. It's uh, by D Tech, and uh, yeah, it's basically a really non maintenance treatment, if you would say it in that sense. Um, you only have to you know you wash your car thoroughly when you wash it, and yeah. it's so much easier to wash than if you wouldn't have a paint protection. Um, you have to you have to control wash it once a year, okay. and then in a way you could say we do a test on the treatment to evaluate that everything is working as it's supposed to when we clean it, and should there be something that doesn't work the way it's supposed to, then we redo that area and that's under warranty. Okay. Well, yeah. well how long is the warranty? The warranty is for nine years. Nine years. Nine years. What? Well, but I drive a lot. Yeah, well, that's a warranty's warranty. If you, I mean, you you have a lot of a lot of wear and tear on your car, especially if you drive a lot. So then it's very good to have a paint protection as well. Okay. So, and also the one year, the annual uh, check uh, was it called control wash. Yeah. So I still have to do once per year, or is it more often? Well, you have to do it once a year in order to for the warranty to be uh, valid. Oh, I see. So if you choose not to, then you, you know, the valid, the um, warranty won't apply. Hmm. But once a year, you come in for a control wash. We go over the car and we have a, we have a special um, a liquid that we use that we spray on the car. And all those rust particles, like brake dust and all the, all the different things that they get on your rims and they get on the side here and a lot in the back, especially in the back. Uh, when we spray this on, we let it work for about 10 minutes and it turns neon purple. Oh, and it'll that start, one. Yeah, it's, it's an amazing product and it just, it, it gets all the brake dust out. So that combined with degreaser afterwards, after we dried the car again, you don't have to clay clay the car at all. No. Oh. The degreaser, it kills all the asphalt, and that other uh, other fluid that we use that takes all the brake dust. So you don't have to physically clay the car because when you clay the car, you can make scratches and. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. All right, that would be interesting. Yeah. Yeah, it will be a good test uh, this winter and summer. And <laughs> yes, it will. <laughs> yes, it will. And also another thing to mention is a lot of people um, think that because you have a paint protection that things do not stick. But the difference is that whatever's sticking to your paint, it's sticking to the paint protection. And it's not directly on your paint to where it starts, you know, all the things that hmm. cause your paint to start deteriorating, oxidizing and all these things. Then it's, it's on a protection. So also when you wash it, the surface of it is so smooth that when you wash your car, it's it's very, very simple. Oh, so I can most of the time just rinse it? Or? Yeah, you should degrease your car once once a month, Okay. Uh, especially in the winter time. And you'll see a lot in the summertime when you're washing your car, the water is just gonna, it's just gonna fly off the car. But now there's a lot of salt, a lot of different things on the, on the paint. So, you know, maybe, We'll put some degreaser on it, of course, maybe up to the door handles yeah. and under the mirrors around the whole car and just let that sit for a little while. And then when we start spraying it, then it, you know, it releases all the salt. So then that, that effect of, uh, of shooting off all the water is going to come back. Mm. Well, does this have any protection against bird poop? 
Um, yeah. I mean, the longer bird poop stays on the car, the worse it is. If you get it, it's nice to just okay. hose it off as soon as you can, regardless if it's glass or it's the paint. Mm -hmm. So, but because I heard that the Tesla paint is not like the, the thickest or the hardest, or some paints are are a little a little harder to work with. If it's non-metallic, okay, it's much more important to spray off the car if you get bird shit because non non-metallic is uh, uh, that clear coat does a lot for okay. the paint yeah but if you have a paint protection on top of something that doesn't have the clear coat it's obviously going to be stronger mm. but clear coat or not thick paint or not I advise to spray off bird mm -hmm. poop as soon as possible mm. all right so I'll let you guys work with the car thank you Mm -hmm. And I'll come back in a couple of days. Sounds perfect. Okay, it's been two days now at the uh, pit stop build fair, and uh, Optimus Prime is done. <laughs> it is more shiny than it was when it was new. <laughs> Holy crap! Look at this, it's so uber shiny. And not only does it look shiny, but it's also supposed to protect uh, the car against all the elements. Um, I drive a lot, so. I guess I need that protection. So you guys did a great job. Thank you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, and what do I have to do now uh, afterwards? Uh, now, the, well, you should not wash the car for another two weeks, just so everything can set. After a week, I know you're crossing the mountain, so, okay. you know, maybe after a week's time, you can hose it off, high pressure it, but don't use any chemicals and don't, no physical contact, oh, okay. basically. And you meant like I need like a control wash of the one. Yes, yeah. uh, once a year in order to maintain the warranty, you have to control wash the car. So then we do a series of tests, uh, get all the contaminants off the paint, and do a series of tests where we basically check that the paint protection is doing its job and um, yeah, that the water is treading off the paint the way it should be and yeah. Hmm. Wow. Looks, man, this car looks gorgeous now. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad you're happy with it. Yeah. Spent, spent a lot of time on it. So. Wow. Did you also do something with the rims? Yes. We did uh, also, there's a ceramic protection on the rims. Oh. So that'll keep uh, asphalt, brake dust, and such from yeah, fastening too, mm. too hardly on it. So it should be, it is a lot easier to clean and basically just by spraying it off you'll get most of it off oh yeah. okay and you know one question many people have is what about the seats the ultra white seats the ultra white seats they're they're definitely the most beautiful seats but um they do tend to stain okay and uh okay let's go on the other side it's, i think it's better from the other side because of the sun it's, it's so white that it's overexposed yeah, yeah, it's crazy. Over here, okay? Yeah. So basically what we did with the seats, we cleaned them up, and then we put on a conservation, and then after that, a leather care cream. So uh, basically what that does is it keeps the leather uh, nice and damp or moist. So, mm -hmm. uh, you know, usually when you get those cracks on the side of the leather and stuff from going in and out of the car, that's because the leather is very dry and that's a process that's going to happen regardless but uh, as long as it's it's moist you're going to slow down that process and it's easier to keep it clean as well so. hmm. yeah it looks great yeah it looks amazing wow okay um thank you very much for the treatment you're welcome and uh i should have taken this treatment before <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's it's very it's a very good treatment very durable very durable. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's going to be interesting when I come back in one year. <laughs> yes, it will be. I, I can't wait to, to see. Yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, but uh, I'm actually going to go on a long road trip now. Long-ish. Uh, I'm going to go to um, from Oslo to Bergen and back again. Uh, so uh, fortunately, there won't be too much rain. Uh, maybe a little bit of rain in Bergen. We'll see. But. Um, Wow, this is just wow. Okay, we have to look. We have to show you the signature look also with the doors open. Yeah, that is just 
uber shiny. Oh yeah, uh, that's it for now then.